Well, renovating your home can be an expensive task, but smartening up your home may be a cheaper alternative. We have tech expert Elliot Chun here with a few smart tech items to better your living space. Good to see you, Elliot. Good to see you too, Carrie. Okay, so we're hearing about, you know, smartphones, smart technology. So smartening up your phone or your home, what does that mean exactly? Yeah, well, basically it means taking an easy way to renovate the home and adding technology because the smartphone is so, the smartphone is so prevalent in our lives mm -hmm. and also Wi-Fi. And why not take advantage of technology and have a cooler space? Okay, so tell us about some of the things that you've brought in that can make our home smarter. Yeah, definitely. So starting at the end here, basically we have a lot of new next generation smart home devices. So last year we took a look at some of the um, first generation stuff like the Nest and um, smart locks and so on. Now this is like the new wave of, of things coming. So okay. this is actually a true sneak peek. Some of this stuff hasn't even at stores yet. Oh so, really? Okay. Uh, starting at our far left here, we've got the Autumn Smart Lock. And is that here? That's that there. And what I love about it is just the design. So actually you can see how it's got a nice silver finish. There's also three other colors as well to match your door and, and be a seamless experience. This goes on your door? Goes on the door. It can install in 10 minutes, and what's cool about it is as long as you have a deadbolt lock, which majority of people do, whether you're in a condo or a house, and it's a great way to add that on there. And you can literally send several keys out to people via messaging system through their app. So you can let in your plumber, you can let in your friends, you can let in um, the guests you want, and then, of course, people you don't want out of there. So maybe there's an, a former roommate that should be locked out, then you oh, can certainly lock them out. Oh, that's a handy. Tap, tap so if you phone. can't get that physical key back, then you can just lock them out. So yeah, use your smartphone exactly. to control that that's right. entry. Yep, yeah, you got it. Fantastic. What's and next? then surveillance is also big too. Yeah. Whether you want to take a look at the outdoors, maybe especially in Vancouver on the North Shore, a lot of my friends are complaining about raccoons getting in their garbage. <laughs> yeah. and, and they assume it's a raccoon, but they can certainly find out now with something like this. So Netgear came out with a line called Arlo. And what's cool about Arlo and this device is it actually shoots 720 uh, HD. So as you get the HD quality, but you can also shoot day and night conditions. So if you do want to oh, cool. put something outside, it is weatherproof. And I think the coolest thing too is it's actually all wires free. So actually you can see here, oh, it's magnetized Neat. so you literally just mount that through the back just like you would say a picture frame right. if you're inside and then snap on and, look and at move that. it to whatever angle you want too right whatever just angle you need exactly and okay. you know if you don't need that base too it's also just a, a fun mechanism Ooh. you can just have out on its own also oh, sure. so just walk around and baby monitor out. home surveillance out indoor outdoor <sighs> All weather conditions. Multi-purpose, and that's from your smartphone as well. From the smartphone as well, exactly. Cool. Oh or even gosh. your desktop too. Yeah. That you see here. Fantastic! Wow, yeah. that would come in handy. What else you got here? And in the spirit of surveillance, so I really love the Canary device as well because Canary is actually right up here. And what's cool about this, uh, it looks like a cylinder device. Yep. It comes in several colors, and it's just a fun way to have. Uh, indoor surveillance in your in your home. So, so you just, where would you put that in your living room? You put room, that in or? your living room, uh, you can put that in your kitchen, and it's a fun way to interact because it does have a microphone, does also shoot in HD. Oh, so you can just shoot, shoot videos of your family shoot doing videos. the kitchen dance yeah, party or you know, whatever so, you do. Someone's at home and wants to make fun of you while you're working, <laughs> okay. they can do that because they have the day off. Perfect. Et <laughs> okay. In every smart home, you need a really good router. This okay. is the most underrated device in the home. In fact, almost half the Canadians don't even know what type of router they have in their home. Okay. Do you, Carrie? Uh, I know. See? I have exactly. one. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, behind every good um, smart home is going to be a router because Linksys has a new Mac Stream device. And AC is something we showed last year with the smart home. And AC is still the standard, let's call it, for high speed. But then the new t keyword is called MU. M I M O or Mu Mimo. Okay. What's, that basically means it's three times your Wi Fi speed. So if you've already got something coming in from, let's say, Bell Internet Service, and then you add this device to it, it'll actually boost your devices three times faster. Oh, okay. So it's really smart in identifying several devices in your home. The just need like a for smart speed, home okay, we like that. Exactly. Okay, so now we're moving on to smarten our car. Yeah, so now we're going to smarten up the car. So now we enter the garage, and I, I have this awesome Black View uh, dash cam. So they're actually front and rear facing dash cams, and as you can see, it's got a nice matte black finish. Mm. So this is really good for, say, uh, an executive car or someone that doesn't want to show that they have a dash cam in their car to prevent theft. Okay. So it's a really discreet way to in install that. The top of the device actually goes on your front uh, windshield. The back is, is obviously for the, your, your rear-facing view. It's great for detecting not only accidents, but also just surveying the roads. And uh, what's cool about that is it hooks up to your car battery, so you're not actually draining battery, and it's just oh, always hooked nice. up to your car. Okay. And again, you can uh, control this to see what's happening from your phone or your desktop experience. Okay. Keep an so eye on things on the road. Good for insurance as well. Uh, I, I brought in the Cobra as well because that's also really cool because it's also Wi-Fi enabled so you can actually just connect to it wirelessly just oh. to survey what's happening and that's a device there and uh, also shoots in HD. Small. Very small. Yeah okay. Yeah.
Cool. And some speakers. Yeah, speakers oh, because, okay. you know, the thing about because what, cars... Because what you have in your car is not enough. Exactly. <laughs> it's so true. And a lot of cars just come with, like, the minimal amount of wattage. And I think this often gets over, overlooked as the uh, car quality, uh, audio quality. So Infinity made by Har Carmen has a great line from Kappa. And here you get a kit, actually. It comes with all the speaking components. It does actually come nicely uh, packaged with um, a cover here. But what I love about this is the fact that you can actually put this into your own car and then use your existing factory components. So you don't even know that that's being so shown. So it's just an extra. Exactly. Just take it in there and it's, it's all wireless. Yep, and the, and the Geek cool. Squad can uh, certainly install that for you too. So you don't have to worry about getting into the wiring of your car. I know I personally would like yeah. to get it professionally done. Yeah, I wouldn't do that. Okay. Uh, and finally, quickly, we yeah, have one more finally, to go. You bet. Yeah, we've got the uh, Infinity uh, Kappa amp. So this is actually like the computer of the car. You can think about it in terms of your speaker components. So this is actually something that you can put under your car seat or in your trunk and conceal that. And it controls the amazing uh, sound quality up to 1,200 watts which is a lot of output. And if you add a sub, you can have that great um, bass experience as well for a full rounding sound. And uh, as I mentioned earlier, behind every good smart home and smart car is an awesome smartphone. Of course. So Samsung has a new uh, Galaxy S6 phone, which is super fast, really nice finish if you actually touch oh, the white one here. Very and nice. the black one I love because it's actually the Samsung Galaxy S6 Edge. So you can see you've got a nice bevel here where it go, the glass wraps around right, right around the edges there. Super fancy. Elliot, thank you for showing all of the fun stuff. I You're got my tech welcome. on today. <laughs> <laughs> if you want to watch this segment again, check out our website, ctvmorninglive.ca. And which one do you want? Everything. Just okay. pack it all up and just put it on my desk. It'll be fantastic. Thanks, guys.